All right, we're here painting our 1965 Alcourt Sunfish Wave. We're uh, talk about some of the materials we're using first. One of the things I get, uh, Jamestown Distributors has them. The, uh, these little paint roller kits come with the rollers, the frame, paint tray, and some gloves. They're around five dollars, so it's a good, so it's a good, uh, a good deal for those. We like these little. Uh, Sorry about the lighting. We like these little sash brushes. Buy them at Lowe's. They're for oil paint, so the bristles work a little better to roll and tip the paint. These in total boat wet edge. This is the blue glow white. Then with just a little bit of the special brushing thinner by a little bit I mean I'd start with a quart can I start off 70 degree day put in a couple of capfuls of the thinner and then see if I like how it's uh, rolling out brushing out on the boat itself so I'm gonna walk around uh, to the other side and we'll get going on a uh, rolling and tipping demo come in handy as does a, a long sleeve shirt to keep the paint off of you. So for rolling tip, put a little bit of paint in the roller pan. Move it onto the roller. I'll do about a foot, foot and a half section at a time. Come back to the pan, dip my brush in there, and then just try to go as straight in line as I can. You can't probably tell in the video, but I'm trying to use just fingertip pressure. If you mash down on the roller, you get paint squeezing out on either side that leaves ridges, and if it dries too fast, then you've got that ridge to contend with. overlap the previous section and then we feathered the paint into the previously painted area. There's my wet edge right there. I'll start outside of it. Oh boy, it's about time to go in I think. That's the sound of Mother Nature telling us to wrap it up for a little bit. 